shovel. Iron shovel. Oh, God! Whoops! Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the second episode of Let's Play Tweak Redux. Anyway, in the last episode, we restarted day one. And in this episode, we're going to go on that journey for sheep and wood. Ah. As I wait for it to load. And there we go. Oh, it's still daytime. I forgot about that. Uh, I'm running at 30 frames as opposed to 60 as I usually do because I have a video rendering right now. So, oh yeah, I forgot those are still going. And I'm just bringing this stuff with me. Oh yeah, you may have uh, noticed I changed my skin. Everyone knows it's Butters. Um, the only difference really is that the hair is new. Uh, my old skin, uh, for some reason, got corrupted or something or other. Hey, time to turn some snow into ice. Some ice. I'm alive. I almost got trapped under the ice there. But yeah, for some reason, my old skin got corrupted or something or other, and uh, when I tried using it, it kind of looked like someone had vomited all over my character. Okay, uh, first of all, just let me set this waypoint. There we go. I told you, uh, Raise Minimap is one of the few uh, few out mods I would actually be using extensively, and hey, look, there's a random piece of and up there not being used. Uh, at some point I'm gonna build a uh, a straight up bridge across this with like two spot gaps for me to jump over so that way mobs just can't walk over it. Because let's face it, this gets boring fast. Uh, oh god. And boom! Cow! Gotcha. On the journey for sheep. I don't think I've ever once found a sheep in a jungle. I found chickens and pigs in jungles. I usually find sheep most often in swamps, but I don't think there's a swamp near here. Ooh, a cave. With... Is that a glowstone or an electric? Well, let's find out. That's a lightning creeper. Water! 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 Okay, I'm done. Okay, that was definitely a lightning creeper, and I was not aware that their lightning could hit you while you were underground. Anyway, free coal. I know I'm supposed to be searching for sheep, but when I see resources, I get them. So, note to self, now that I don't know the textures, that yellow is definitely lightning, or electric, as they are more supposed to be known as, but... Ah. Oh, do I still have... Yeah, I still have single-player commands in here, so... If I find myself in a giant pickle, you may see myself cheat, but... I'll try not to. Oh, darn it, a dark creeper. I don't want my torches to go bye-bye. Oh, yeah, I should start calling them Jawas now, since that's what they are. If you guys don't know what a Jawa is, then you've never watched Star Wars, which means that you have not lived. Damn it. Oh, well. Yeah, they don't do any damage, they just troll you by taking away your lights. And it looks like this was just a fail cave anyway, except for some orite, which is something that you find in Mo Mobs and Ores. Oh, there's only two. I can only make a sword out of that. No, oh, I was hoping to get a pick out of it. I do still have that spare stone pick, so... Might as well just grab all this coal while I can. You can never have enough coal. Aha! Now I can make a pick. I can make a pick and a shovel now. I don't know why they only... I'm gonna leave the rest of the coal, by the way. I don't know why they always seem to only come in groups of two. I never see them in more than groups of two. Hmm. Well, I might as well head back to the house and make that bridge I was uh, telling you guys about. Ooh, and that waterfall is actually perfect to get me up to there if I so wish. 
I right, better take out my sword in case something decides to want to creep up on me. Anyway, uh, climb, 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 climb. I wish to be up. I wish to be up. Yeah. Hey, I'm Tarzan. I'm swimming up the waterfall. E even though he technically wasn't swimming up the waterfall, he was climbing through the rocks, but... I was young, so I always thought he was just swimming up the waterfall. Ah, a cave. Fire creeper, go away! They explode in a radius of fire. Which is deadly if you're near a wooden house, and oh god, my sword just died! Well, thank god I he exploded when I was not next to him, but... Yeah, fire creepers and lightning creepers are the two most dangerous ones, I'd say, because your stuff can disintegrate. If you die, your stuff disappears if you're in the fire. It burns up, like if you died in lava. Oh god. But the best part about this is that it temporarily lit the area up. Ah. Oh, a lot of coal here. I don't know why they used a modified version of the song, I love you, you love me, we're one big happy family. I'm sorry I watched enough Barney as a kid. And then I think back on that show, that giant dinosaur was probably a pedophile. I don't feel cave, but at least I lit it up so nothing will spawn. I can grab this coal later. I'll, I'll probably actually do that off screen. And... Came through that way. Ooh, a skeleton. Yes! Gotcha! Got myself some arrows, too. Did I get any bones out of that? I did not. I didn't expect to see a spawner this low, but... At least this entire cavern's lit up now, nothing will spawn in here. Always worth it to make sure nothing spawns. If things get too crazy with me being not able to find a sheep, I'll just spawn three in and kill them. Oh, I just went the wrong way. That is a long line of coal along the wall. There are some giant coal deposits. And this cavern is actually a tiny bit expansive. I might actually decide to make a house out of this at some point. Sort of just like a little mini retreat. Alright, my house is on the other side of this, isn't it? Yep, that's where the uh, creeper went off. I live! Yeah. Let me grab the, uh, stuff to make the stuff with the things and the stuff in the area. No, I don't want to put the stone hoe in there. I want to put the orite with the charcoal. I don't want to put... Oh, that's that's actually charcoal. Uh, might as well cook this while I'm here. Alright, and we'll... I just dropped a torch, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, while that's cooking, I'm going to go ahead and make a bridge. First, I'm going to eat a little something, so if I get hit by something, my health regens. Nom 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 nom. Oh god, did not mean to do that. Okay, I'll start the bridge from right here. It'll go right to the other bank. So that way I don't have to worry about, you know, anything trying to kill me. Alright. I might make a house on the water. I, haven't I have not decided where I'm going to make my house yet. I have to do some actual location scouting, which I'll do off-screen for you guys. I'll do all my actual exploration on-screen, except for me finding a house. Alright, I'm only about halfway across. Hey, there's a squid down there. What's that? Hmm, nothing's on the sand, so... I hear it, though. It might be... The squids might actually be making footstep sounds, now that I think about it. Which would actually be rather weird, since they don't have feet. And usually, if they're on the... S if the sand's underwater, it would make a much different sound. Okay, and... There we are. Most mobs won't be able to jump through that, so... Here we go. Jump, jump, and run. Just put some lights on here. I know it's over overly lighted, but you can't ever have enough light. 
give me my stakes, and give me my stuff. So yeah, Aura and all the stuff from Mo Mobs and Auras works exactly the same like it does in regular Minecraft, so... There we are, I have an Aurite pickaxe as the lag spikes, which I will be using after my other pickaxe dies, and an Aurite shovel, which I'll be using after my stone shovel dies. And I've got charcoal, coal... I'm gonna go ahead and put the charcoal... the bigger stack of charcoal away. And I think I have torches. No, I do not have torches in here. Might as well make some more. Ooh, that worked out perfect. Okay, I've got two stacks of 64 and a stack of 21 torches. That's more than enough to be lighting stuff up. Uh, might as well just put this away. Keep the sticks on me. And the leather. Okay. Continuing on! Hmm. That's another just random island up there. Oh, god, lag spike. I know why these lag spikes occur now. It's because Fraps, uh, the way it works is it only works up to a certain amount of space and then it makes a new video. So, anytime you uh, hit a lag spike, Fraps is making a new video. So, alternative, I, I could just hit F10 every two minutes just to be safe, but. Ooh, pumpkins. More cows. Oh, cow... cow apocalypse, And for some reason, a lag spike unrelated to fraps. That was weird. Cows, all your meat are belong to me. I care not for your species. I am... Whoa, there is a lot of cows here. I'll never have to worry about food again. I'll leave the pigs alone for now. Oh, God. That lag spike, I don't know what the hell happened there. Oh, come on, pig. Stop moving. I want to take a running start to kill you. Oh, well. There we are. Get all this leather that I can. I'll actually be able to get leather armor for once. I usually get iron armor before leather. That was weird. What the hell? What the hell? Oh, for some reason my alarm went off. That was weird. Even though I did not set an alarm. Uh, <laughs> even though he was dead, he still made the splat sound when he hit the ground. And it's becoming dark out. Huh. That's weird. Uh, that must be one of the structures structures generated by mo mobs and ores, and I don't see a sheep anywhere. It's just a whole bunch of cows. I'll take a look at that house, and then I'll get back to mine. Ow. 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 Is there anything in here? No, there's nothing in here. If memory serves me right with these houses, the there's usually... Like a block of diamond and a block of gold in there, but since I'm not using a cool in exchange, that's extremely useless to me. Yeah. I'm gonna spawn in a bed just to make the night pass by faster, simply so I won't have to sit around waiting. I'll destroy the bed right after. And plus it'll allow me to test the viability of my spawn. And it'll allow me to reset my spawn, which I'll be really happy about. But me destroying my bed right after... Get out of the way! Get, get out of the way, you goddamn piece of... Uh, it's hard to see at night. I have to actually get closer to my computer since there's actually a glare. Okay, I'm so far I'm surprised nothing has spawned to try to kill me. Hi, Earth Creeper. God, do not go off. Do not go off, you troll! Gotcha. Yeah, Earth Creepers are the troll of the game. If they go off, you have to dig yourself out. It's really annoying. It's especially annoying if you're, like, tunneling underground and you're getting close to something, and next thing you know, an Earth Creeper goes off. You get so disoriented. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give myself a bed, sleep the night away, and then immediately destroy the bed. And I'll do it on screen. So. Okay, just let me reorder everything. No. 
I was gonna actually start cooking that, but I forgot I have Somnia mod, so... If I have Somnia mod and I, le and I let, you know, sleep while those are cooking, it'll actually cook them. Which would be a violation of my rules that I have set. So, where's the bed? There we go. Game mode. There we are. Set this down and sleep. I will be cutting this out. Awake am I. Destroy this. Pick it up. Go back to game mode. And destroy. And go back to game mode. There we are. Oh yeah, while I was sleeping I got hungry. Wondrous of Somnia. Okay. Just throw... No. I don't want to throw the hoe in there. I want to throw this in there. And... Hmm, I think four. No. Four will be more than enough, but I'm just being safe here because I don't know if I'm going to put anything else in there. Okay. Now, continuing on for the journey of sheep. I'm going to start looking in the jungle now. Hmm. Actually, I'm going to fast-forward my search for sheep, so I'll let you guys listen to some badass music while I go roaming through the jungle for sheep. I will stop it once I come across sheep, so hopefully it won't be too long, but... Hmm. You know, you never know when you'll find sheep. Alright, see you guys soon. Hi guys, I'm back. Uh, I think I found a dungeon here, actually. Huh, yeah, this is definitely Mossy Cobble. Hmm. Oh god. Damn you, sand! Go away, sand! Huh. I thought there was going to be a spawner down here, considering the mossy cobble, but... Maybe the sand just buried the spawner, that I think about it. Yes, it did. The sand actually buried the zombie spawner. Which means there's going to be a chest in here somewhere. Might find some iron in it. Come on, shovel, don't fail me now. So yeah, I conquered myself a dungeon here, even though it was really one of the... I think it was the closest dungeon to the surface I can ever remember finding. Well, at least now one thing I know is I'm not going to be short on glass when I make my house. Come on. I don't understand why the sand would bury a chest, but... And now on to... Yeah, this is this is about as fast as iron. Oh, they, yep. Oh, I forgot. I do have a stone shovel. Yeah, it's about as fast as iron. The uh, morite or orite, rather. 
What do we got here? Redstone, gunpowder, wheat, cocoa beans, an empty bucket, and a saddle. The empty bucket's nice. That takes me three iron. Oh, and there's another one. Two empty buckets, string, and bread. Uh, go ahead, put this in there. I don't need the cocoa beans for anything. I don't need these arrows yet. Uh, I don't need the glowstone. I'm not equivalent exchanging, so... Now that I think about it, this might have been a bad idea. <laughs> okay, well, now that I'm out of the dungeon, back on the search for sheep. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything more else interesting, so I'll see you guys soon. back and I finally found a single sheep. You're trolling me, right? One sheep? All that distance traveled for one sheep? The There's not even any in here. One sheep. One. Uno. That's it. You, sir, have made me angry. And it's getting dark. Uh, I'll search for another sheep. Um, I'm going to cheat here, actually, because this is just a search for sheep. So, there. Uh, okay, speeding up again. Hopefully I'll find another sheep relatively soon.
guys, we're basically back at my house, but I want to show you these guys. Wild ocelots. You have to approach them very slowly, otherwise they run away from you. In order to tame them, I believe you need to give them fish. They're basically cats. Hold shift as well. But unfortunately, I don't have any fish because I don't know how to make a fishing rod. But yet, I got through the jungle, did a lot of climbing, a lot of Tarzaning, a lot of dying, well, almost dying, a lot of crying, which because I sped it up, you guys didn't get to hear. Seriously, I was crying like a freaking faucet. Anyway, let's head back to the house where it's nice and safe, where I can finally make a legit bed. Snort to you, sir. Snort to you. You forget I let you live there. Boop. And there we are. We are here. We have a lot of wood now. Yep. Looks like I actually have extra charcoal. So let's just put all this back. There we are. Got a very large chunk of wood. Some stands, some extra wool. Some string and gunpowder. I can make some TNT if I want it. Pumpkins for a farm later. Gonna actually fill these up with water. I wound up not needing any of the, uh... What I wind up not needing? Oh, any of the wooden planks. Dewey. So let me just put that back. I'm gonna just go ahead and fill up my buckets now. Hey, it's dark. If I remember really, nothing can spawn on ice, so... I don't mind the fact that it causes currents. I've got water now. I can make myself an infinite water source whenever I want now. Get over here. There we go. Uh, that would be in this chest over here. And while I'm over here, might as well make myself some pants. So that way it doesn't look like I'm walking around without pants on. There we go. Yay! Uh, yeah, I also need to make myself a bed. Forgot about that. How did I forget about something so important as a bed? Anyway, now I have a legit bed. Yay! Sleep time. Alright, I should take this opportunity to let you guys go. I will see you guys next time when uh, I wake up. See you guys next time. Oh, uh, before I let you go, make sure you guys leave me your suggestions for next episode, since now that I've got a bed, I can do anything I need to.